Welcome to Preform Line Products. The following presentation illustrates the recommended hand application of the squirrel deterrent system. Open up the clamp by pulling apart the jaws until it is locked in the open position. Rotate the trigger until the bottom rests below the retaining wall in the clamp. Close the clamp onto the trigger. The clamp is now set. Locate the initial installation point of the first clamp and while holding the bottom by hand, activate the clamp by bumping the trigger into the cable. The clamp will snap closed around the cable. Assemble one collet onto the conductor next to the clamp you just installed. Secure the halves together with a pair of push pins. Next, install an end plate onto the cable by opening the slit and sliding it over the cable. Snap it onto the collet by lining up the appropriate notches of the collet with the slots in the disc. Begin to install the spinners by placing two spinner halves around the conductor and slide them together. Secure the spinner halves together with a single push pin in one of the four corners and slide the spinner next to the collet. Continue to add spinner sections until the desired coverage of the cable is achieved. The standard SDS-005 is supplied with a set of five spinners covering five feet. Assemble the second collet and end plate onto the cable as previously shown. Slide the collet and end plate next to the last spinner installed. Again, the collet should slide into this spinner. Install the second clamp, leaving a gap of one to two inches between the clamp and the end of the collet. This ensures these components can freely rotate. You have completed the installation of Preform Line Products Squirrel Deterrent System. The featured Preform product is manufactured in the United States and is backed by the experience and field support that PLP has been noted for since 1947. All safety guidelines set forth in the appropriate application procedure for this product must be reviewed and followed prior to installing this product. The installation shown is intended to illustrate the application method of the product only. It is not intended to supersede any standard utility safety guidelines and practices or use of required protective equipment.